If you are rooted with Magisk, and facing safety net failed issues, do not worry, as I will show how to pass the safety net test, so without wasting your time, let's start. Let me show you the root status of my device, and the Magisk version I am using. And as you can see, I am rooted with the latest Magisk. Next let me show you the safety net status of my device using a safety net checker app. So when I run the check, you can see the result is coming as failed, both basic integrity and CTS profile match are coming as failed. So to solve this, launch any web browser, and type exactly what I am typing, which is, universal safety net fix. This is a Magisk module, which we will be flashing it through the Magisk app, on the search results page, tap on the GitHub link which says KDragon. So one thing to note is that if you are on Magisk 23 and older, then use the Ryru version. If you are on Magisk version 24 and newer, then use the Zygisk version. So be very careful in choosing the right file, so if you are still with me, kindly like and subscribe to my channel. And also do leave your comments below. I am on the latest Magisk, so I will use the Zygisk version, under releases, just tap on the version number, and on the next page, scroll down until you see safety net zip file, which is located under the assets section, just download the zip file by tapping on it, as you can see the file is already downloaded. So once the zip file is downloaded, it's time to flash this file from Magisk app. The latest version of safety net fix at the time of making this video is version 2.4.0. So launch the Magisk app first, navigate to the settings option, scroll down, and make sure that Zygisk is enabled at all times. And also I would disable the deny list option as I will use other method to hide root, which I will show in a new video. Meanwhile if you want, you can watch this video on how to hide root, just click on the i button. So if you want, you can disable the option, enforce deny list. Next, from the Magisk home page, tap on the modules section, and then tap on install from storage, locate the safety net fix zip file, and just flash it via Magisk app. So once the flashing process is over, just reboot the device to apply the changes. Once the device boots up, let's go ahead and check the safety net status of my device using this safety net checker app from Play Store. I will leave the link of this app in the description. As you can see, we have successfully passed the safety check and it's showing pass for both basic integrity and CTS profile match. Now if you have custom ROM and if the previous method did not work, then launch Magisk and navigate to settings and then to configure deny list. Next tap on the three dot icon, as shown on the video, and then tap on show system apps. Now search for Google Play Store and add the same to the deny list as I am doing. Just check the box and enable all the options. Next search for Google Play services, and enable only these three options, and this will do the needful. Check my next video on claiming 5TB of free OneDrive cloud storage. Thank you.